Hello everybody, my name is Prana, if you guys don't know who I am. Today, I'm going to be putting up a chicken fence. Getting ready for my chickens to come here. Super, super excited! But I gotta go get ready. Done. Okay, All right, so this is the fence that I bought. Demon dog. So I'm gonna go try to set it up and see what happens because apparently, apparently it's kind of hard to do. Yeah, demon dog, you go outside. Yeah. What happened with the chicken coop is it's covered in ants. There were ants like literally infesting it. So I'm about to get some vinegar spray because I heard that that helps and I'm gonna clean it with vinegar spray and pray that that keeps the ants away. Look. So yeah, they need to go. All right, this is half water, half vinegar. I'm just gonna spray, which is safe for chickens, by the way. I had to do my research on it. I'm just gonna spray it. I have a couple days until they get here anyway, so this should already be dissipated and everything when they get here. I'm gonna move it probably closer that way. Try to get it away from whatever nest keeps following it. It's so annoying. What's cool about this coop is that this tray slides out for easy cleaning and then you can just slide it back in. <clears throat> now I'm going to move it. It's really hot today. I didn't think it was going to be hot. I don't know what I look like. I also don't know if you can even see me, but basically I got a no shock hen pen that's uh, movable so that I can move them to and from different spots in the yard so they don't ruin the ground. And I got, I think 64 feet, which is way more than I need, but I'm gonna grow eventually. So I just went ahead and got it. Also, I might have to go inside and wait for it to stop being this hot because my phone is just gonna stop recording. I also lied, I'm gonna put it closer to there because this is so in the sun that I'm scared they're gonna get too hot. So I'm gonna give them a little bit of shade. I literally can't even see myself because of how bright it is. <laughs> so I think I'm just gonna chill inside and eat lunch so I don't pass out and die before doing this. Hello? Oh, aren't you just so proper? Eat your sardines. Okay, so what I'm gonna have for lunch, potatoes with black beans and then kale. Also, look at my eggs. Oh, so pretty. All right, I got my buffalo and my ranch or my potatoes. I've been trying to be a vegetarian lately, but more so not vegetarian, more so just like avoiding commercial meat, which has been a lot easier than I thought. I thought it was gonna be harder because I love pork and stuff like that. I ended up going to the farmer's market and got some like grass fed, humanely raised pork and that curbed my desire. So I've been doing really good otherwise. I've been really, really well. I've had a couple slip ups, but it was like pork rinds and that doesn't, that doesn't count. Okay, so I just moved it over there again because there's a bunch of holes right here and I don't want to put my freaking chickens in a spot that has a bunch of holes because I don't want them to get hurt. And they're obviously animal holes and I don't want animals to just be like trapped in there either. I moved it over here to where there's only one little hole the best I could do. There's a hole literally everywhere else. I'm gonna try to set up this cute little fence. <laughs> 68 feet. What? What the heck? <laughs> Let's just focus on the first step. Lay the netting out in a straight line. Oh. <clears throat> okay, I'm gonna time lapse this. Y'all, 68 feet is so much longer than I thought. That's like half the backyard. Oh my God. Okay, I'm gonna stretch it all out now. Make it all wide, you know? Okay, the next step says, starting from one end of the fence at the bottom of the net, weave the gate post, the post with no spike, through the hen pin netting as per the diagram. What? Post with no spike. That would be this one. No spike. It says there's supposed to be a string. Or maybe that's not a string. Those are just arrows. I'm so stupid. Oh, that's lovely. Oh, 
Class is trying to play with Nova and they keep walking on my fence. What? I gotta watch a video. Okay, I just... Oh, wow, I'm bold. Okay, don't look at that side. I just watched a video and I'm just stupid. Let me keep going. I'm gonna do a time lapse though because it's not interesting at all. Okay, so I laid all the... <laughs> I laid all the bars seven feet apart. So now I'm going to weave all of them and stab them up with these little things. But I'm gonna time lapse it too, so... Have fun watching another time lapse. Woo, time lapse studio. Oh my God, that took forever. But I got it done. I have a meeting soon, so I might just roll it up and set it down for tomorrow or the next day. Okay, I just set it right here for right now. I'm gonna put all this stuff in the coop and then deal with it on another day because I'm tired. See you on another day. All right, so I just got home from my apprenticeship. Can you tell? Can you tell? And I'm gonna finish putting up the chicken fence and get it all set up so that the chickens can come tomorrow. Oh, I'm so excited. They're gonna be like, bark, 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 bark. It's just wide open if we ever wanna put something in there. <laughs> Before they get here, I'm going to try to find like some cinder blocks or something, like pavers to put in there so I can put their food and their water on top of it because they're very messy. We also don't have a hose that needs to be changed. Hey, there's some bricks. Whoa. Whoa. I told the yard people to not cut the grass in the pen because that's chicken food. And they did it anyway because there was a language barrier and they just didn't understand me. I came out and saw that they did it and I was just like, oh. I don't know where I'm gonna put these yet, but I'm gonna have both the bricks like this and then put the food or water on top of it. Excuse you, excuse you. That way they don't knock it over. That's pretty in the middle. It's just super crooked, but that's the ground's fault, not mine. So. All right, I feel better now. It's finally ready. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Next video is going to be me bringing the chickens here, which I'm going to get them tomorrow, but this video is already so long and I want that video to be just about bringing them. Next video is going to be about that. So make sure you tune in to that video, like subscribe, turn the bell on. See you guys later. <laughs> that was awful. Love you, bye.